Hey everyone, my name's Silver, welcome back to the channel, and today guys, I got my very first Yu-Gi-Oh! video on the channel. And today guys, we're going to be talking about a very, very important card that I think is very broken in the game, and is just beautiful and works in every deck. Guys, you won't believe how well this card literally works in every single deck that you could possibly play. Now before we continue, I will say that this video is not for the weak of heart or the easy triggered. So if you're easily triggered or you'll die from watching this video, please turn back now. As in we are going to break the mystery of the most powerful card ever in the game. And I mean the most powerful. Alrighty. So guys, as you may know, Yu-Gi-Oh! is a multi-massive... Wow, yeah, my brain just literally fried itself there. Yu-Gi-Oh! is a massive TCG or trading card game that has been around for a very long time and is owned by Konami. And honestly, this card has been around as probably as long as I can remember. And I'm surprised that more people don't use it for fun. I believe it is on for the Forbidden List. I haven't actually looked. But guys, we are going to be breaking down why this card is the most powerful. And it is. You ready? I don't think you're ready. I honestly do not think you're ready for how powerful and broken this card really is. I mean, guys, I'm almost having a heart attack here. The card I'm talking about is, in fact, the Pot of Greed. That's right, guys. The most broken card in Yu-Gi-Oh! is not Dark Magician or Blue Eyes or Red Eyes or any of that. No, it is Pot of Greed. Why? Well, let's decode Pot of Greed. Pot of Greed is a monster is a spell card. I almost said monster card. I am really tired. It is a spell card that allows you hold on to your seats to draw two cards from the top of your deck. Even though it doesn't say from the top, it says draw two cards. Guys, this makes and breaks games. Because if you run three pots of greeds in one turn, you can literally draw six cards. Play everything in your hand. Just play your three pots of greeds you had. So, this card is by far the most powerful, and there is a deep and rich lore. There's so many cards I'm not even going to try to get into. But, let's go over why this card is the most broken. It lets you draw two cards. On top of your regular turn draw, you get a total of three draws in one turn. And that's not counting any other draw cards you might have. This will allow you to get out so many, so many advantages that you might need in the late game that you did not have at that moment in time. I mean guys, it lets you draw two cards. But we're getting out ahead of ourselves. What decks can you use it in? Well you can use it in every single deck in the game. Yeah, it is not restricted, it's not good or bad, it's not an archetype deck. It can be used in every single deck. Your blue eyes, red eyes, Exodia combo deck, your Exodia deck, your black magician of death I don't know. Um your elemental hero destiny hero combo deck it can be used in all of them it will let you get the cards you need and if you play it at the right time like they do in the anime all right Siegfried the party's over first I activate my pot of greed magic card that lets me draw five cards the spell card pot of greed I'm throwing down the spell card pot of greed <laughs> And now I'll use its magical charm, and then draw two additional cards from my deck. You will get the miracle draws. Um, the only card that I would think that is slightly better there is no card at all. Honestly guys, this, this pot of greed is a 10 out of 10 pot of greed shards. Or jar of greed shards. No, it, it's, 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 it's pot of greed shards. 10 out of 10. Honestly, guys, if you do not own a copy or several thousand copies of Pot of Greed, you're doing yourself a crime and you should go get some. But, until next time, guys, I've been the Silver Wolf, explaining my very first broken card video. And guys, we'll try to tackle all these in the nearby future. So if you have a broken card, let me know down in the comments below. And guys, go check out my giveaways. They're going to be ending soon. So you're going to want to leave a comment on both those videos if you want to enter the giveaways plus i have a third one coming at the end of this month hopefully so i will see you all later